please welcome my friend, Chris Jenner. girl what's happening ain't nothing how was your thanksgiving it was so good yeah it was so good where was dinner at kylie's house kylie did thanksgiving this year you know it's such a great feeling i have so many kids that i can give a holiday to each one of them and get away with it yeah it's like yeah so I, I gotta ask you yeah there was a story that jennifer lawrence <laughs> ended up naked <laughs> in your closet a few weeks ago. Yep, she did. <laughs> First of all, how did you and Jennifer Lawrence meet? Tell that story. She was a big Keeping Up With The Kardashians fan. And somebody from her team called me up and said, would you surprise Jennifer on her birthday, this was a couple years ago, and give her a birthday cake, like you'll be the surprise. And when I walked out with this cake, she was so excited and so excited to see me. And then we just had this little texting friendship from then on, so it was okay. fun. She's so, such a great girl. Okay. Now, okay, fast forward. Yeah. Let's get to the part where <laughs> this woman is closet. naked in your closet. <laughs> <laughs> okay, well, she had some time off and I invited her over for dinner. We started having a few cocktails. And we were having so much fun. And so, you know, as girls do, when they all get together, we ended up in my closet, like looking at clothes and some stuff. And she started trying some stuff on. There she is now, in my black sequin Tom Ford dress. I don't know where I'm failing as an interviewer. How <laughs> did she end up naked <laughs> in this damn closet, Chris? I know. Well, it was the shot right before that that she didn't see. She just took off her jeans and went for it. There was a little video too that I think I had to show you how much fun we were really having after 22 martinis. <laughs> <laughs> there we are. <laughs> That's right. how we do it at my house, Steve. Yeah, I see yeah, that. Yeah. Hey, look, your family is about to welcome baby number seven. Kim's having a girl. She is. Uh, her, her, Kanye. Oh, how do you think North and Saint are gonna handle this? I think Saint is gonna be a little confused, and I think North is really excited. <laughs> so it's yeah. really sweet. Well, you all are doing great because you all just signed a huge contract, 150 million, <laughs> to extend your show. <laughs> oh boy, you know, we just gotta work hard. Play I'm, hard. I'm damn sure trying. Blessings. Yeah. We're yeah. very blessed. We, we really are. are. But the thing that I'm the proudest of is how grateful that we all are to be able to have so many people that have had jobs because of our show. Right. I think that's so yeah. Yeah, incredibly that's, yeah. important to point out. I'm back with my girl, uh, Chris Jenner. You came to our daughter's engagement party. Oh, the best. Came to the house. You have such a beautiful family. Man, I got good kids. Man. Yeah, you do. God. That was so fun, and, and I love Marjorie so much. What yeah. a lovely, lovely girl. Ooh, thank you, Lord. It's a cutie. Yes. She yes. loves you. Yes, she do. Hey, let me talk about it. How does Christmas really go down at your house? Does Kanye do the playlist for the music? <laughs> what, what, what happens? There's, um, we've had the same Christmas Eve party literally since I was 22 years old. It just gets a little bit bigger and a little bit crazier every year, as you can imagine. Really? So it started off where I would do the turkey, the dressing, the stuffing, a traditional Thanksgiving dinner. Now we have somebody help, you know, make it. There's a lot of people that come, but, it's Santa and elves and really good food and maybe a reindeer or two and it's so much fun. I noticed this right here. I noticed uh, you got all your grandkids a set of pajamas for the holiday. I did. I counted nine sets. Mm -hmm. Now last I heard it was seven grandkids. Oh, I see. Where Anything this is going. we need to, yeah. I'm just... Well, this was a gift. You know, Oprah had these pajamas as one of her favorite things, and it's Burt's Bees Baby. And Burt's Bees Baby, they have the most amazing, beautiful, 
organic cotton pajamas. I went on the website and they were all sold out. So I called the company and I said, come on, don't you guys just have a few more pair left? And that's what they sent. Do you do your yeah. own Christmas shopping? Yeah, I start Christmas shopping in July. In I July. do. July. Like I see something and I, it's so good, so I think I need that for this person. And Oh, I, I'm a professional. You guys haven't done a uh, Christmas card in a while. You doing one this year? We are doing one this year. Yeah, we are. And um, my daughter, Kim, it's her project. So just have to stay tuned, you know, when All right. she's ready. Well, you're an incredible mother, an incredible yeah. businesswoman. Thank you. We're going to play a little bit of uh, this game called, uh, <laughs> called Chris's Choice. <laughs> now, this is going to be interesting because I know you really do speak your mind. So I'm going to give you options, and then you tell me which one you prefer. OK. Uh, this is whatever you prefer. OK, here we go. Okay. Would you miss out on baby number seven's birth, or would you throw away your coveted home videos? Maybe miss out on number seven's birth. I mean, yeah. I could never replace the memory, right, the video. Yeah. And the baby coming anyway. Yeah. All right, Chloe's Good American Jeans or Rob's Arthur George onesie? Well, I wear a onesie literally every day from Arthur George, and I have the jeans on every day, so that's a tie. Yeah. Okay, this, one, this is a good one. Would you live with Kim and Kanye again or lose your assistant for a week? That's easy. Live with Kim and Kanye again. Okay. In a heartbeat. Yeah. I actually miss them. Would you go on Courtney's strict food diet for a month or work out with Chloe for two weeks? Work out with Chloe for two weeks. <laughs> for sure. Would you spend a day Snapchatting Kylie and Jordan or Kendall and Gigi? It's a tie. That one's a tie. Well, you're a smart woman. Yeah, that one's a tie. That's a smart woman. They're yeah. all fun. Yeah. Anything that'll get you in trouble is a tie. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. I like yeah. that right there. It's a tie. It's a tie. Chris, you and those girls have just stayed just very, very kind people. Aww, and that's what you. I wish that everybody would understand about you and those girls. Thank you. You're very kind thank people. You. So thank you for thank coming. You. Thank you for hey, having Hey, folks, everybody, give it up one more time. For this lady right here, keep it up with the Kardashians there Sunday nights at 9 on E. Keep it right here. We'll be right back. Hey, you made it to the end of this video. I got a lot more that you're going to enjoy, so just click to watch the next one. And make sure you subscribe to always know what's happening.